I don't know where you're at, but we're having a heat wave here today. And I'll tell you, who doesn't love a nice quick meal for dinner that you can just put together in about say 10 minutes and uh, it's you're good to go, right? And you don't have to heat up the kitchen. Well, today I'm making a watermelon arugula salad with some feta cheese and some red onion, a nice little balsamic dressing. You're gonna love it, it's delicious. You could even you know, throw a little chicken on the barbecue and then add it to this and your meal is done. I'm Rockin' Robin and I'm gonna show you how to do it right after my chef joke. Okay, so here we go with chef joke number one and number two will be a little bit later. All right, so why did the cantaloupe jump into the pool? Because he wanted to become a watermelon. <laughs> All right, watermelon arugula salad means we gotta have some watermelon. So here we go. We got a ourselves a nice ripe one and I'm gonna cut it up and probably, you know, depending on how much salad you're making, that's what's gonna determine how much watermelon you put in there. So, you know, I'm gonna use uh, out of this just, you know, probably a little more than a half of this watermelon. So I'm gonna cut this up into bite-sized chunks and then they're going into the salad bowl. So next I'm gonna add my greens and I'm using a combination of spring mix and arugula. So I'm gonna to toss in a handful of mixed greens and then a handful of arugula. Now keep in mind that when you add the greens, it seems kind of fluffy and very full, but once you add the dressing, it is going to shrink down. Next I'm gonna add some very thinly sliced red onion. I like it nice and thin, so it's just kind of delicate in there and it, and it adds some really great flavor. So sprinkle in as much of the red onion as you like. I probably did here maybe a half a cup. I'm gonna give that a little toss and then we're gonna work on our dressing. So for our dressing, I'm gonna start off here with a little bit of olive oil, let's say three tablespoons. And then to that, I'm gonna be adding a really nice balsamic vinegar, about two tablespoons. I'm gonna whisk that and then add a little bit of salt and pepper. And then give that a very nice whisk. Now before I add that dressing, we're gonna add a couple more things to our salad. Some fresh basil, fresh out of my garden I might add, and some fresh mint. Now the mint goes really well with the watermelon, so don't leave it out. Now you're gonna use a small handful of both the basil and the mint. And I like to chop both of these up pretty fine. And now we're ready to add some dressing. I'm gonna give that dressing one more whisk before we add it so everything's nicely combined. Give that a toss and then we'll add our final ingredient. You wanna make sure that everything is well coated. Okay, so our last ingredient is some feta crumbles. Now you could also use goat cheese crumbles if you prefer. I'm adding a bit more because, well, it's good. Now doesn't that look amazing? I can't wait to dig in. Okay, I've decided it must be time for chef joke number two. Here we go. What do you call young avocados? Avocados. <laughs> okay, it's time to serve up this beautiful salad. This salad tastes so yummy. It has got that nice sweetness from the watermelon and the little peppery from the arugula and the creaminess from the cheese, it's delicious. If you love salads, you're gonna wanna try my cucumber tomato salad with a slightly sweet and tangy French dressing. Click the link on the screen and it'll take you right to it. I hope you enjoyed today's video. If you did, let me know by smashing the like button. And if you'd like to leave me a comment, I'd love to hear from you down in the comments, so leave it there and I will try and get back to you. All right, we'll see you back here next week for another Rockin' Recipe.